They're like grubs. That's four dollars for a rat. Bear bread. It's 6.30 a.m. January the 5th. 6.30 a.m. January the 6th, 2021. I'm in Vang Vien, Laos, Southeast Asia. Stuck here because of Corona. And I've come to, to come and watch the arms giving ceremony, which is where the, where the local monks come to receive their offerings from the residents of the area. Yeah, I'm gonna show you that today. So I'm at the temple now and the monks are just preparing. So if you come to Asia and you are gonna film or take pictures of monks, or you do, do go to the arms giving ceremony in any of the places in Asia, there are some rules. You have to dress, uh, you have to completely cover your shoulders and your, your knees. You have to dress conservatively. You, you can't touch a monk. You don't walk up to the monk and speak to them during the ceremony for 100%. It's, a, it's supposed to be sort of a silent, tranquil ceremony. I'm gonna try and speak quietly. If I can't, if I feel like I'm gonna be disrespecting them, I'm just gonna film it for you guys so that you can see it because it's interesting anyway. You're probably bored of hearing my voice. I'm just gonna walk around the back streets of Vang Vien. I'm gonna leave my bike here that I borrowed from the hostel. Hopefully it won't get nicked, I haven't got a lock. But I thought leaving it in a temple would probably be the best, best place to leave it. You see the monks getting, getting ready to leave now. I'm just waiting for the stragglers, I guess. So I'm gonna go and get in position now so that I don't just have to follow them, walk behind them. I hope my bike doesn't get nicked. This is just a straight up morning market. All these ladies will probably have grown all of this in their gardens. Oh, what is that? Kaibo? Hi. Oh, baby, baby oh. chicken. Whee! Fresh fish caught from the Mekong today. Oh, you got like a puffer fish. Weird Ooh, ugly fish. Bao nyam. Bao. Papau. 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 Wow, this is super cool. They've got everything. They've got fresh fish, all different types of fish. they got baby chicks. they got okra, pumpkin, different mushrooms. Really cool. Different herbs like kaffir, lime, dill, coriander. This is so cool. So yeah, when you're out traveling, go out for a walk in the morning. This is bamboo shoot that they eat. And this is banana flour that they cut up into salad. I don't know why I pronounce salad like a lao then. And this is banana leaf. It'll have rice, rice and banana mushed up together in it. It's like a sweet snack that they like. Wow. Super cool. Wow, big bits of meat. Hello. Sausages, wow. Sabadi, uh, tao dai. Sit pan, so a dollar for a sausage. It looks like a nice sausage. And they sell things for offerings for the temple. Sabadi, tao dai. Tao dai. Song pan kip. So this is 20 cents. Con what? Uh, con, uh, yes, yeah, so it's for the temple. <laughs> temple da. Maybe that's what it's called. Da for the temple. And we've got some steamed dumplings here. Sabadi. Con mu bo. Mu. Ah, sorry. Wow, loads of tiny fish. Hapan nung kilo. Hapan nung kilo. Ah. Oh, so this is just loads of different tiny fish and they're actually they're gutting them really quickly look how they gut them they probably think I'm crazy because I'm just some random stranger on my own walking around Southeast Asia 
filming the locals. <laughs> oh. Gin bo? Uh, tau dai? Si sip. Si sip. Si sip. So that's 10, that's 40,000. That's four dollars for a rat. That's the most expensive meat I've seen here. A jungle rat, you pay four dollars for it. Maybe four dollars a kilo. I don't even want to know what's in that bag. Oh, nearly actually missed the, uh, the thing I came here for, the arms giving ceremony. So that was the arms giving ceremony or tack back. I've never seen that before. I, I, I even, I joined a Thai friend in, in Thailand to, I joined them in the ceremony and offered them food. But it was just one elder monk that came along and there was no chanting or anything like that. That was really cool. Maybe the ceremony is slightly different region to region. But that was, an, that, was, that was a very ancient ritual that you've just witnessed there. Very quick. The monks, they will, they, they can't eat after 12 o'clock, after noon. So they come early in the morning and they eat twice a day. They'll eat first now and then they'll have lunch around 11 o'clock. But after that, they then won't eat for the whole day. They can have tea or water. I've come a bit further away this time so that I can speak a little bit. The lady's just got ready. She, she'll get on her knees, place the food to her head as a sign of respect. You see how she puts the food to her head? Ooh. And the way that they do it is the, the eldest monk will receive the food first and it will go down in age order. And you can see them swapping food. You, they know what each other likes because they're, they're probably brothers by now. really beautiful, really peaceful ceremony. But I think that's it, I think I'll leave them to it now. Look at this woman with all her bread. Bear bread. Oh, 
so much good food. All fresh. Oh, half a duck. All this food's ready to eat. Wrapped in banana leaf. You see more here, wrapped in banana leaf. It's cheap and sustainable, so it's good. Got some, got some snails here, some eels, and then some baby catfish. Oh my lord. I don't even know what this is. That's another type of rat. Uh, Pasalawa? Noa. So the, the name of this is Noa. It looks like a squirrel. <coughs> oh my goodness gracious. I'm not even joking. That's a dog. That's a dog foot. My boy. That definitely is. She's saying that isn't. That is a dog. How die? She doesn't even want to sell it to me. She, she doesn't. That is a dog. Straight up selling dog meat. What? And then these frogs. Oh my lord. Wow, look at this one. Beautiful. Wow, big carp. Really cool fish, man. Beautiful fish. More rats. They like eating rats here. Straight up. They just eat rats. That's, that's some crazy stuff. I think that is a a cow penis and balls, I think. And that's cow tongue and that's goat brain. Oh my lordy. Uh, Pasa Lao Bo? Name? Huh? Duan. Duan? Duan. So these are called Duan. 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 And uh, the lady says Seb Lai. Seb Lai. I'm sorry I don't know more, more about this food. It's just, if I'm honest with you, I haven't eaten most of this food. A lot of this food I've not seen. I've not really seen rats and all these different types of frogs and things before. They've got some really nice sweet things like kanum, coconut kanum, sabadi, taudai. No. Um, ah, doi, doi, doi. So that for one, one, one of these, um, it's mm, ten cents, you. and it's made of it's like a coconut batter, a coconut and egg batter. It's really, really good. They're actually selling big banana leaf here. Maybe these ladies make food to go on on the. Maybe they're street vendors, so, so they might need a lot of it. Wow, look at that. Just down from the road in the lower land here you can see the more traditional houses over there I didn't know about this market this oh there's more squirrels that is crazy and oh my lordy I don't even know what's going on with that what is that is a that's a rat split in half big chunks of fish Hey, Falang! Hey! I've never seen a Falang here for a long time. No, no, no. Ah. <laughs> oh, there's actually a Falang. What's your name, bro? Arnie. Arnie. I'm Craig. Nice to meet you. What did you do here? I've been here 20 years. You've been here 20? Are you from Scotland? Norway. Norway? Yeah, Nam Song Garden. Nam Garden, Vang Vien. <laughs> Guest house. Back, back to the guest house. All <laughs> oh, right, I know what that means. <laughs> you got anyone here at the moment? I guess they were. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> they came yesterday with two motorbikes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But apart from that, I haven't had people for a long time. Yeah. Can, I, can I check out the view? Yeah, welcome. So this is Nam Song Garden. That's me, yeah. <laughs> 20 years. Yeah. He's been here 20 years. Yeah. Just, yeah, sat here having his morning smoke.
Yeah, there's actually another Falang. So when, when, when Falang is a foreigner, when us Falangs see each other, we're quite surprised now. Wow, look at the view. Look at the view. Wow. This is just off of the road. The mist is, is messing with the camera, but trust me, it's beautiful. Hello. Hello. Oh, what a fluffy doggy. Hello. Hello. Sweet. Oh. Ah. See you later, bro. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Maybe come and have a beer. When you're around in, when you're traveling around wherever you are, not just Southeast Asia, I would fully recommend go out in the morning. Sabadi! Go out in the mornings because that's when everyone's most active. That's when the city's active. Or the town or the village, wherever you are. Sabadi! So that concludes my morning walk around Bang Vien today, now Southeast Asia. If you did enjoy it, like, follow, subscribe share my videos so that other travellers can see them. Anyway, appreciate you watching. Peace.